What's up guys, your boy Russ again, back with another one. Right now we're in Raven. Uh, if you've been following the channel for a while, I did a vlog about comparing the mid-muffler delete to the Corsa Extreme exhaust. So you guys know that this modification was long, long overdue. So what we about to do is, we about to head to Coachella Muffler uh, Exhaust, or Coachella Muffler Custom Exhaust um, in Rockville, Maryland. Um, you know, you guys know I don't mind driving uh, far or whatever to get to uh, a place that has great reviews and they do great work. So we're on our way there. Uh, we can already pull up here soon, probably in about the next five, ten minutes. Um, and we're going to see if these guys can put Raven on a lift and install the Corsa Extreme Catback Exhaust System. Guys, I've been waiting patiently so long to get this mod. Um, like I told you guys, it's not a cheap mod. It's about $1,600, $1,800, um, depending on if you get discounts or where you buy it from. Um, but it is well worth it. Um, the car is going to breathe better. Um, we're going to do this first. Um, like I told you guys, once I hit my mileage point, we're going to start doing major mods such as headers, uh, probably a cat delete, um, upper lower pulleys, you know, injectors, things of that nature. We're going to start cranking it up to get some power out of this car. Um, I will be trying to track it this summer. Um, hopefully I can get off work um, to be able to take it down there a couple times, but I'm trying to find uh, some drag wheels um, and get some drag tires. So, you know, I can just swap out the two rears and do what I gotta do with the track and then, you know, swap them back. Um, but I'm excited guys, uh, this is the first step um, as far as, you know, helping the car, you know, breathe better. Um, other than the intake, I installed the intake. Um, but this is definitely gonna open it up for me and I'm excited about it. Like I said, um, I'm taking this thing slow guys. You know on Raven, on B, on B I went extremely crazy with that car. Like I bought a lot of things in a short period of time and you know now the wife drives it. So <laughs> I'm not saying it ain't getting it's, it's just due, which is really not because she just commute back and forth to work. But you know, that car was meant to be like a show car. I like stopped on it because I was gonna go crazy with the interior, you know, getting the pieces, hydro dip, things of that nature, um, put the stars in the roof, all that in that car. But once I realized that I was gonna get rid of my truck and try to get the track up, um, or Hellcat, um, you know, I just stopped making, I stopped putting mods on the car. Um, so with this one, I'm gonna take it slowly I'm going to get it exactly where I want it. This is not going to be no show car. I ain't here trying to compete with nobody on how my car look and this, that, and the third. I just want to make it look good a little bit or just look good. But I want it to be fast. Like, it's not about, oh, I'm going to dump a trillion dollars into, you know, putting it on bags and freaking, you know, uh, flip-flop paint job, all that goofy stuff. I'm not, I'm not with all that on this one. You know what I mean? So we're just going to stick to the basics. Uh... Get her looking good on the outside, which she's already looking good, you know what I mean? Sometimes simple and plain is better. Like, I get so many compliments on the car just for it being just black, you know, things blacked out, you know, looking good. So, and like I said, I'm gonna just keep doing me, keep staying in my own lane, not worry about what nobody else doing. Um, and we just gonna keep rocking, we gonna keep rolling. Um, but we ready to pull up here soon. I'm gonna jump out, let you guys see the car. Um, let you guys see the shop Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully they can get me in here Like it's Monday morning, bright and early They opened up 11 minutes ago So I pray that it's not a million people in there trying to get their exhaust done I hope I just pull in, say look, I need to put my cat bag exhaust on, what's up? They be like, okay, we'll get you in And then boom, 
but we'll see you guys so stay tuned <clears throat> so we're here guys we're here at coachella like i said um they were able to get me in this is before you guys hear that sound Great, put it up. Don't forget to thank, get it out the trunk. It's the man right here, he's gonna be taking care of me. Yes, sir. That big track hooks, everything up here. You guys see. I'm gonna miss my purple tips though. They are for sale. <laughs> If anybody is interested in my carving five inch tips, they are for sale. I cut you a deal, send them out to you. I think one of them got a little scuff underneath the bottom. I think I scraped the curb one time. So, but that's it. It still look good. Ain't nobody gonna really get up under your car to see that little scuff on the exhaust tip. So it is what it is. But yeah, guys, we out here in Rockville. You see address 5410 i think the road is let me check it out for you guys i don't know why this thing is doing this all right it's 5408 randolph road 5048 randolph road it's out here in rockville maryland once you pull up to the shop, you'll see this. And the muffler shop is right there. This is what the building looks like. Like I said, these guys got great reviews. So I know they're gonna take care of me. Right now you see Raven up on the left. She's going under the knife. Um, she's gonna sound extremely, extremely good once they uh, put this exhaust on. And I can't wait, guys. Um, this is one of the things you should do when you have a Dodge, um, any type of Dodge, you know, V8 and up. Get a nice little exhaust system. You can get exhaust on V6s, but I'm not a fan of them. Um, but V8s, yeah, definitely get an exhaust system. You don't have to go to Corsa Extreme. They got all kind of exhaust. Um, you know, the Boiler Attack, uh, everything, man. So. You can check it out. Uh, there's plenty of videos out there with uh, exhaust comparisons and exhaust installs, yada, yada, yada. Like I said, I'm just putting this on my channel because it's me, this is my car. Um, I want you guys to see the difference on my car, uh, how it sound, and I can't wait. Uh, shout out to everybody that support me, everybody that sub to the channel, uh, liked all the videos. Um, like I tell you guys, each and every video, Every like matters, every subscriber matters. Um, we on the road to 5K. Uh, and we're just gonna keep going, man. You guys might get less and less vlogs from me um, due to, you know, just life things. You know, I work a lot. Um, got things I gotta take care of and do. Um, so I'm not able to vlog as much as I want to. So I'm normally just grinding, um, doing what I gotta do with my family or take care of my family. You know, going place with my family, um, things of that nature. So, you know, Hellcat TV is just a side thing for me. It's not my main thing. It's not my main source of income. I'm not out here going crazy, going stupid. You know what I mean? Trying to break my car, trying to get caught up with the police. None of that. You know what I mean? I'm just enjoying my car. Paid a lot of money for it. I'm just going to enjoy it. Uh, this is probably my final car as far as when it comes to performance, things of that nature. Uh, and i'm not gonna sell it trade it none of that i'm pretty much in this car until the car is destroyed or breaks or whatever you know what i mean even when it breaks i'm gonna get it fixed and we're just gonna keep rocking and rolling so unless it get destroyed you know in a crash or something then i'm just gonna keep the car um but i love the car i love everything about the car um i'm happy i bought it will never regret buying my hellcat i had too much fun with this thing this thing brought me all of you guys to the channel um 
since I got the car. I think I only had like 400. No, I probably only had a couple hundred subscribers or something. And then I got the Hellcat, it went crazy. So it is what it is. I inspired a lot of people. A lot of people see the things that I do on my channel and they do the same or they, you know, inquire about things. You know, I talk to them. I comment on everybody's uh, comment on the channel on all of my vlogs or whatever. So whether you get a like, thumbs up or a message, whatever, I do it all. But I'm here for you guys, man. Like I said, this is just a hobby for me. It's something I just do part time and I enjoy it. So can't wait to keep getting after it, man. Definitely can't wait to hit the track, you know, with the car, you know, see if I can <laughs> launch properly <laughs> since people want to give me flack for that. I was going to do a, a relaunch video of how to launch my vehicle, but I'm like, you know what? I'm not even going to waste the tires just to show people that I know how to launch my car. Um, first of all, if you ain't got a Hellcat, I, you know what? I ain't going to comment on that. You guys know what I'm saying. Um, but yeah, <laughs> we just going to keep rocking, keep rolling, guys. Uh, 2021 and beyond. Um, stay tuned for the results on this. Uh, like I said, it's up on the lift. Just getting started. Um, can't wait to hear this thing. I know it's going per real good. Um, and we're going to be straight. All right, guys, so stand by. Look at them tires. Sheesh, I love them nittles. Yeah, turn it on. Get a couple revs. I'm ready. extreme make sure you get it man
right guys we just wrapped it up um they ain't find no leaks um if it is leaks i'll come back and see if i can rectify that um there's one thing the exhaust tip set out a little too far for my liking i told him once i change my diffuser i'll come back and i'll let uh i'll see if i'm going to get them to cut the pipe you know to, to push the exhaust tips in just a little bit but I gotta see on that new diffuser I'm getting from uh, Chrome and Carbon. Um, it's gonna be super dope. This is super, super dope diffuser. Um, and I can't wait to see that on the car. I hate wearing a mask, man. They freaking mess up my beard. But yeah, can't wait to have that on the car. Uh, but I just want you guys to hear it real quick uh, while I'm driving. You guys got to hear it while I was idling. Now I'm gonna let you guys hear it while I'm driving. in sport mode right now I put it in manual so you guys can really hear oh shit damn that broke traction a little bit whoa that broke traction <laughs> damn Let's see we get them gurgles and pops Boy, that, that broke traction. You know, these tires are real good. These knit old NT05, so that's kind of crazy. It broke traction like that. Let's see if I can get some. Oh my God. Look, this thing seemed faster too. I don't know what's going on, but it seemed like it got some juice to it. must be breathing breathing guys this thing got some juice like I could feel it on the throttle this thing is juicy right now but uh of course extreme guys check it out um, like I said so many vlogs online or on YouTube of course extreme boiler attack yada 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 um, they both good systems um, flow master all that magna flow but for these cars, for these Dodges, man, Corsa Extreme and Borla Attack are like two of the best exhaust systems. So you can check out all the different vlogs or videos they got on YouTube. Obviously, you're listening to mine right now, but the car sound, sounds amazing. I can already smell it a little bit, so we may have a leak. I don't know. some juice now with the exhaust so like I said if you guys are on the market man get this exhaust get this exhaust I can't say it enough get this exhaust it's gonna make you a 5.7 yeah 392 whatever sound amazing so check this exhaust out guys. exhaust got to get settled in too I got to break it in it's gonna take a little bit but overall I'm pleased um these guys did a good job they did it pretty fast it only took probably about uh what I got there if it's it probably took an hour 45 minutes for them to get it done and the price wasn't bad either way to do what we got to do today um but guys once again i want to thank you thank you thank you for subscribing to the channel for watching my vlogs make sure you like this one give it that thumbs up it don't cost you nothing it's for free um make sure you subscribe to the channel and uh we're gonna keep on going guys so until the next one peace